Hi! Whenever you're using a laptop and connecting it to another display, such as the monitor on your desk, or a smart board, or a projector, you may have to change your display settings. To do that, you right-click out on your desktop and go to Display Settings. And if you're plugged into a second display, you will see two monitors here. Currently, it's showing that my laptop is the only one that is seeing anything, and my desktop monitor is not. So if I scroll down where it says multiple displays, I can opt to have it only on my desktop monitor, leaving my laptop black, or I can duplicate it, keep changes, and now whatever I see on my laptop, I also see on my desktop monitor, or I can extend it. And when I extend it, it basically gives me a super wide screen where I could drag things over from one screen to another. And so I've dragged this off of my laptop screen, and you can't see it, but it's now over on my desktop monitor. And then I could open up something else and work on it here, and have something else working on my desktop monitor. Um, most of the time when you're working in a smart board setting or a projector setting in the theater or the commons, you're going to want to duplicate so that what you see on your screen is exactly the same as what the people in your audience, whether it's students or colleagues, are seeing on their screen. Another current um, scenario that's popped up a few times is if you are displaying a PowerPoint presentation. So even if you have done the duplicating process, right, so both what you see on your laptop plus what the audience sees on their um, display, whether it's a smart board or a uh, projector, or your desktop monitor. <clears throat> You've already got it on Duplicate, but then when you go into PowerPoint and you go to Present, since we've moved to Windows 10, this is how presenting PowerPoint looks. And so over on my desktop monitor or the smart board or the projector, um, it looks the way you would think a presentation would look. And that's fine. I've got my notes here. It's sliding through. The problem is if I have a link embedded in and I want it to open a website and take you to a, an external link, it's only going to show up on this screen. It's not going to show up on your smart board or the projector for your audience. To do that, you've got to go up here into the PowerPoint's display settings and you want to duplicate it so that what your audience sees is now the same as what you see. And you've lost your notes, you don't see those second slides anymore, what's coming up next. But if I click on a link, it's going to load for you on the laptop, but it's also going to load for your audience on that second monitor.